in-state guy, I know this really bothers you more than maybe some of the other guys. You, know, you take it personally. I know you take all losses personally, but especially for us. Yeah, I mean, definitely. You know, I mean, it's a loss and it hurts, and, you know, we just got to go look at the film, reevaluate, and, you know, start the clock again. You know, we got 365 days and try and get better, you know, this off season, get into the grind mode, and we'll remember this day for the rest of our lives. Did you tell early on that it was going to be that kind of night? It seemed like you guys got a little rhythm going for some defense. So not, I mean, not really. I mean, we went out there every drive trying to make something happen. Um, you know, I would have liked to run the ball a little bit more, but, um, you know, it, just, it is what it is. You know, we're trying to make our shots downfield. You know, we had open receivers, but, uh, you know, they, they, they had good players as well, you know. Got a couple uh, – Balls knocked down, tip, things like that, interception. Uh, so I mean, it is, it's the way of the game. Why do you think it didn't work offensively? Uh, I honestly don't know. You know, I thought we had a good head on our shoulders coming into this game. Uh, you know, I, I thought we were ready. You know, practices that we've had, I thought we were ready. Uh, so I don't, I don't know. I don't really know. Are you impressed with Clemson's defensive front? Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, they're you know they're, they're a good team. I, mean, I, I never said that they weren't a good team. You know, they're a good team and. Uh, you know, they, they, they have some big guys up front. I mean, you can handle them, but you know, they bring a lot of pressure and a lot of blitzes, so you got to try and account for those two as well. You Best. almost came here. Can you see your program getting to where theirs is in the next couple of years? Yeah, we're building. You know, this is a building process for us. You know, we, uh, you know obviously we did better than last year, so next year we're going to try to do better than that. And so it's just a building building blocks that we got to do, you know. We were unfortunate tonight, but it is what it is. Based on the way you guys played the second half of the season, is it shocking that you couldn't get anything going offensively or defensively tonight? Uh, I mean, I thought we had a good game plan coming in, you know, and so we were trying to do certain things, and it just weren't working. You know, the final team. score tonight, is that indicative of the gap between the two programs now? Not at all. Not at all. You know, the, so, you know this rivalry, so, uh, you know, anybody can come out and play. The records don't matter. Coach Mushin said that you guys knew what was going to come for Clemson's defense. No, you don't. You guys were prepared for it. Is it yeah. frustrating knowing what's going to come and still not being able to stop it? Definitely. You know, it's frustrating, uh, you know, seeing the things that they do, and you know how to block it, and you still can't execute. It's frustrating to an extent, but, you know, after that play, you got to move on. You know, you, that you can't dwell on the pass. That's our biggest thing. You can't dwell on the pass. So you have to move on and keep going and forget about it and keep the drive alive.